Meanwhile, French officials are welcoming U.S. President Barack Obama's pledge to push for a climate accord that includes legally binding agreements. French President Francois Hollande addressed one of the more divisive issues at the conference. How much aid developed countries should provide to developing nations to help them adapt to climate change and reduce their emissions? CCTV's Kate Parkinson has this report from Paris. French President Francois Hollande held talks with African leaders in Paris on Tuesday. One of the biggest debates during the climate conference is how much aid should rich countries give poor ones to help them cope with climate change and reduce their emissions. Hollande said France wants to lead by example. The world, and particularly the developed world, owes an ecological debt to Africa. France wants to set an example, and the finance destined to fighting climate change at a global level will switch from 3 to 5 billion euros annually. A substantial part of that will go to African countries for investment in renewable energy and to increase access to electricity. Meanwhile, U.S. President Barack Obama met leaders of Pacific Island nations, countries that could disappear beneath the sea because of climate change. Referring to his upbringing in Hawaii and Indonesia, Obama said he understood their concerns. I'm an island boy. I, I grew up on an island and uh, understand both the beauty but also the fragility of island ecosystems. Obama said the climate conference cannot simply serve the interests of the most powerful countries. He said the most vulnerable must also be protected and that their voices here in Paris are absolutely essential. Kate Parkinson, CCTV, Paris.